Bro, my clock's true, make them go broke, drop top, swag shop. Store down half a tree and take out every clock's out there. So now people, we're there back with some quick updates as I may say, but first, respect for tuning into another video, yeah. And from when you see the thumbnail and the title, then you already know what is on the agenda today. And right now, we see we're in which dancehall artist Vice Cartel and Spice and also producer Russian is reacting to Ramish situation. And we all know what has been popping on the internet with Ramish, so basically in send man to go box down TJ and also Maya, which is TJ's girlfriend, get caught in that altercation and them also eat her to just the same you see me I say so you know that a lot of persons have been bashing Ramesh for all of this you see me I say and basically the Jamaicans them and the people them overall both internationally and locally I say yo if you cancel Ramesh you see me I say so right now we have Spice here yeah he's kind of venting you see me I say and Spice just a let out everything people and also we have Vibes Carter share an Instagram post where I react to the situation and evil producer Russian you see me I say but people before we get down into all of that yeah right now we have dancehall artist Javilani as I may say and Javilani was doing an interview with the fix podcast on YouTube as I may say and basically Javilani stated that I am of the baddest clock song and not vice cartel and people for all of those who don't remember the song check out this I'm on a rock brand new clocks for foot every girl shook well, Javilani even stated that I went Theme clocks and come out at them time the vibes got the clocks tune them start to get recognition. People want to share in the comments and all of that. And here I'm not gonna talk out the thing. As I may say, just check out this clip. Did officially approach you about doing work with them? Clocks. Clocks. Because no, aside no. from, from cartel, you you have the clocks on for yeah. Yeah, biggest mm. clocks. Huh? Probably the biggest one. Cause when my, my tune drop, I that make cartel tunes that get views, you know. You never did there a million till my tune drop. Man, I ask them, I did go look on here and see it, but it's a different time. Come on, <laughs> <laughs> a different time, but enough yeah, tune did pass, enough yeah, tune did pass million and twenty million views then time. Like, evil so it cartel probably didn't make it research the clear. Yeah. Evil yeah. cartel tune. Yeah, 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 yeah. so, bro, my clock tune make them go broke, drop top, swag shop, store down half a tree, and take out every clock out there. Eh. Well, don't break about that. Up, yeah. It is a flex thing. England three times for a week. Inside, you never do that in a lifetime. Who? Drop top. Uh, you make him go three times at England for a week. Three times. Inside, you never do that in a life. Three clocks. When me drop a uh, tune, I can ask him myself. So honestly, people, do you all agree with Javilani right here that uh, him of the biggest clock song? And do you also agree when him state say, yeah, and when input out theme song, a so comes cartel's song start get views on YouTube, etc. and reach million. Yeah, share your thoughts down into the comment section. Is it say? In my own personal opinion, yeah, me really feel like say, at the end of the day, Javilani kinda get over himself. Is it say? And him just uh, over exaggerate the situation. But people, that is just my opinion. Share your thoughts on it. Also, people, we see we're in which vibes cartel and Russian link up. Is it say? And we all know what is going on with Ramesh on the internet and I've seen Vibes Cartel put out a post a story overall and also Russian and people has been speculating say yeah basically a Ramesh them attack you see me I say yeah and basically Russian took to his story and Russian stated that the same ladder you used to climb can be the same ladder you fall off Watch your step, you see me I say, and basically enough people I say you are Rami Shimawan, you see me I say, because you don't know say at the end of the day enough people don't like where Rami pull off over the weekend at Rebel Party. And we also see we're in which also dancehall artist Vibes Cartel also reacted to the situation also people, you see me I say, and Vibes Cartel took to his story also. And basically Vibes Cartel I say, yo, puppy no who be frightened. And we know the Jamaica slang we say, yo, doppy no who be frightened. And Cartel was also playing his song in that background. You see me I say, doppy no who be frightened. My granny said, doppy no who be frightened. Them I talk about them. You understand what I me mean, people? So basically people more want to share your thoughts and all of that down into the comment section. You see me I say, and we all know that Vibes Cartel and Ramesh no good. You see me I say, if you notice from Vibes Cartel come out, him no link up with Ramesh and Ramesh no post him nor say nothing about the artist. You see me I say, and we all know that all of this is coming from the time when time Vibes Cartel
tell the state that yeah basically Shenzi and Ramesh thief him song which is Lodi etc you see me I say so we all know the history dear people and we also know that producer Russian and Shenzia was allegedly in a relationship so people who not be the judge of that you see me I say but right now we also see we are in with Spice yeah basically Spice is bashing Ramesh from all angles you see me I say and we all know that Spice and Ramesh is in a bitter water because a long time Spice have warned the people them about Ramesh because basically Spice has said yo Ramesh a fighter thing and Ramesh used to pay people yeah not to play our song etc you see me I say so right now Spice Event. And we also see we are in which Romy sent out an apology to Maya and also TJ and both of them kind of reject it. You see me I say? So right now we have Maya here is sending a message. And basically Maya say yo she can never like Ramesh again. You see me I say? And Ramesh will just stay for him part and make she stay for her part because a one man she look up to and a god. But people hear what? Check out this from Maya. Yeah, mega age for life is 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 now coming back from this with me and all me stay. You see, once people dead to me, people dead to me. Are you dead to me? I'm not enough people now go on to come out and talk. I hear everybody Santa Claus, and that's fine. You're not my Santa Claus, though. You're not my Dana. You're not my God. I want God me. I have another one up there. So, so when I need to in another dealings, you don't know me. me yes, yeah, so right there, people. My arm, make Ramesh know. So, watch, I know we don't need to in another dealings. You see me? You're not to know me, and me not to know you. And at the end of the day, she basically has said she will never forgive Ramesh people. You see me? Everybody a big up Maya. You see me? I say, because basically, Maya stand up and fight with her man, etc. You see me? I say, and and really and truly evil spice to say yo maya is a hero speaking that maya is a hero me not care how no one look upon the situation but maya is a hero modern day hero i don't know if she get my message but when the incident i'm gonna send her a dm on tiktok immediately when me see it because me i tell her said hurt me soul it hurt my soul and a long time from each other things like this. The only difference is that he was caught this one time. Maya is a hero. And she should be applauded. Me raise my hat after Maya. Because the girl stand up and defend herself and defend her man. A man they run her and do and see like them no see. And the same girl, them and who if I don't want to kind of keep silence for no time is near or no next. Remember, say a long time, people make bad comments. I run me send people go beat them, you know. Remember, say a long time this is happening, you know. I don't know what I want to know, you know. I don't know what I'm talking, you know. Remember, say like me say, you know, this is the person, you know. It's just caught on camera this time. Because I saw God work. But remember, say a long time you do them something, a long time you fight against people, a long time you hold down people, a long time you send out others, a long time everybody come round you know how you stay. But people, we also see we are in which JCF has sent out a report stating that Indicom is probing and investigating the situation. Is it me I say? So as you can see on the screen right now, yeah, this is the report, and at the end of the day, to people right now, it is in the police and and if Maya and TJ really decide to hear them go press charge Ramesh can be in a lot of trouble and even the policeman and Jay to just the same as the man say so at the end of the day you don't know say everybody a blast Ramesh and really and truly this is a big stupidness Ramesh do you see me I say that is why everybody really want Ramesh to get cancelled by corporate Jamaica you see me I say because really and truly we know say Ramesh is a businessman you see me I say and them man they really and truly the corporate Jamaica everything them really want to do a Ramesh them call so really and truly people I want to share on honest thoughts and all of this but also right now I'm going to make you check out what Spicer say yeah I want to drop on honest thoughts down into the comment section yeah and basically me, me know what to really think about this you see me I say me I talk about the man them where sit back and watch and allow the incident to happen me I talk about oh it never turned into one brawl where the man them were up on the scene we see when the man thump down Maya oh they never come to our defense we say yo I fuck with this I want this everybody just a walk normal and I act like say them immune to violence against women 
Now I'm going to explain something to you, and this is one big problem that happened in a Jamaica. You see the incident that happened, a lot of people don't take it light because someone did not laugh about it, and someone did not act like they don't hush hush, and they don't tight lip about it because of 100 US and 500 US. But I'm going to tell you how deep I look into the situation. When Ramesh get out, I forgot box down TJ. And you want to sit down and realize that to, to this day, we could have been mourning the loss of someone, say somebody could have dead. Never tell you how deep me looking at it. Yes, when I see the man jump and kick TJ in him head, remember one kick, him could have dead. Remember, I could have dropped from the asphalt near to where I'm dropped. I remember, I watched the video and I watched it over and over. That's why I could have told you when them top the Mayan man did dead. And no man never take it up on them head. So, how is it that now Jamaica is so immune to that type of violence there? But let me explain something. When TJ dropped from the asphalt, they saw, and them kicking him head, you know, say so that one kick and him could have dead. How about me put it another way? When we say Maya are different herself, how about as women sometimes when we go, me don't know about Uno, but me always have a little knife in my bag or a little something to me defense. Look at pepper spray, any little thing could have gone. How about when the man did a fight her Maya, she take her something and give her one, one stab her in dead. And then Uno lock up Maya and say Maya to go to prison and then all of Maya life gone down the drain because of your command. And you come back and say sorry and feel like you put a band-aid over it and everything for us hush hush. You see, sometimes when we do things, we don't think about the severity of nobody else. And this is all Ramesh is. I'm going to explain to you, Ramesh, because more you listen to this, you know. Because you come to the defense of your family. In our situation like this, where you could have taken somebody's life, you come to the defense of your family, but you don't realize that everybody are family. The whole of we are family, the whole of we are family to feel. You see the same thing we do to TJ, you might act it out physical, but a long time you fight against people. So that's why I'm one, what kind of riches you have? Because you don't reach in your mind, you don't reach in your thoughts, you don't reach in your spirit. I don't understand how you have achieved so much, how much oh God has blessed you with so much, but still you want to stop a next man food. You see, see him, we're like, oh, you are fight against, you said them go fight against TJ physical. Remember, say, years, you do the same thing to me and fight me out. And the same way, like, oh, you talk about your family. Remember, me have a son too. I remember me as a mother. So the same way, like, oh, your family need to eat and your son want to eat. You must remember, say, somebody else's son want to eat too. So you take my foolish advice. This is one first warning from God and there's many more to come. Because you're not really apologizing you now. A lot of people don't know the difference between apology and damage control. You're basically a marketing genius like myself, yeah, sometimes. But you're just a market. You're just a marketing genius. So it's not an apology, yeah, guilt. You're just a damage control. But some people are just blindsided to the fuck. But you know why me I talk about it? Because if you did me, you never did ever keep silent. You know when we remember vividly the first time when Obia man come out, come tell like mommy and say, Oh me and Obia people, you was the first one run go buy a bottle of rum. Years, fant up years, you are fighting Romish for no reason. No reason at all. So sometimes when you see the people them on the internet, I want to feel like a people don't like me or a people I make bad comments at the same 300 girls them where TJ tell you about you have where you use to manipulate people and then you send my internet to make bad comment about me because nobody from Jamaica in them right mind and sign now I make them comment there with certain people that make on the internet about me you conspire it but you feel like say, people don't know so today, me have a come talk and tell her, say, I know long time, so you do things that hide your hands and come out to the public and act like you're a good face, but you need to stop it because this is your first warning from God. You are manipulate people, you are a user, you are use the TikTok of them, you use them to stop people, you are, you, you are trying to control the whole life. You notice as the TikTok of them get at your zoom in upon them because you want, you want control. You want control, and the reason why you send people go kick down TJ because you couldn't control him. So you want control him in a one different way because you never know. Said so them I record it, so you didn't want to have that a bubble under the surface. You didn't want that to have it. You, you didn't want that fear bubble under the surface. If you put fear in the TikTok of them heads, so you are done. Because you want to be the don and you want to be the boss. And you want people for free. You use your money and manipulate people, but everybody you can buy out. 
And then some of them so fool because guess what you do now? Me hear TJ open him out and say, Come by your office, come by one lion. No, him come by your office and you tell him, say, if you send one lion, come give you. So the TikTok of them never think, oh, you are used the whole of them and I spin them and I circle and I take for them lion and I give back to one lion and them have it say, Oh, the boss send me a lion. So you tell TJ, say, if you send a lion, come give you. And you recycle the lion. So basically then, let me break it down. You take a lion from TJ and send it to Gogi Swissly and tell the Swissly to send your lion and tell, take Swissly lion and send it to Gogi J then. So you're over here and recycle lion. And then them have it in them head now saying, yeah, the damn, the damn send me a lion. Blood clot. <laughs> hey people, Mama Spice not easy, you know, Mama Spice say rummage over TikTok a recycle lion, as the man say. But anyways people, I want to share on the honest thoughts and everything we want to see in the video and what Spice has said basically, as the man say. Yeah, and also we have come to the end of the video, so remember to give this video a like, yeah. Subscribe to the channel, turn on the post notification bell so that you can get all of the latest updates from Flavor Media Entertainment TV. And people, who already know Oh, we do the thing already. Peace, love, unity, bless up every day, every time. I'm out.